Hi everybody, it's Deb from d, d Art Gallery. Today I have a 16 by 20 uh, inch canvas that I put down a thin layer of the Artist Loft Flow Acrylic White. And all my paints today, I also added a, just a little dollop of the Vallejo Pearl Medium, just to give them a little shine. And the base coat also has that added to it. So let's go over my colors. My first color is Amsterdam Sky Blue Light. My second color is uh, Liquitex Basics Cadmium Yellow Medium Hue. And my next color is, I had a navy paint and I added the Artist Loft Metallic Black to it just to darken it up. My next color is Amsterdam Vermilion. Very pretty color. My next color is Artist Loft Green Yellow. And my last color is a combination of Artist Loft Metallic Blue and Liquitex Basics Phthalo Green. And let me show you consistency right away. I do have some paint left over. It just, it leaves a little trace and then disappears. And pouring medium today is two parts Floetrol, half a part Liquitex gloss medium and varnish, uh, one part paint, a uh, squirt of GAC 800 was added to all my paints. And I did thin my paint out a little bit with my combination of 90% water, 10% Floetrol. And today I'm doing a kiss pour. I haven't done uh, very many of these, so it's an uh, experiment for me. And I've already got my paints poured in my two cups here. And what I did is I used plastic cups, but I really didn't like the lip that was on these cups, so I did cut it off just so I'd have maybe a little bit more control over when I go to pour my paints. And I did put the paints in these two cups in um, different order. Uh, one cup has the dark colors on top and the light on the bottom and the other cup is reversed. No silicone added to my paints today. So let's get started. I'm just going to try and kiss the paint here in this upper corner and come down with it. Like I said, I haven't done very many of these before. And I think I'll have plenty, plenty of paint here today. And then I'm going to take and just run a ribbon up the side here. And then I'm going to reverse it and run a ribbon down this way. And run the rest of my ribbon down this way. And why not do it over here? Just playing around with paints here today. See what we get. Now, because I do have paints left over, I can pour in a little cup again and add more if need be. We'll just see what we get after we tip. Okay, so let's get tipping here. And I will have to tip quite a bit to this other side.
And I'm going to turn it around and do a little more tipping this way. I really do like how bright it is down in this far corner. And I'm hoping to keep some of that. Going to take a look at it here a minute. And I'm going to be tipping this way now. There is still quite a bit of paint on this painting. So I have quite a bit of paint to play with here. And now I'm going to tip down to this edge here. And bring it back. And just take a look at it. Okay, I am going to get the paint off this far edge down here. And bring it back, hopefully. And I'm just going to take another look at it now. Okay, first I'm going to be tipping into this corner over here. And just take some of that off and bring it back. And take another look. And I'm going to go take a little bit off in this corner over here. And bring it back. And take another look. I'm going to try and take a little bit of the paint off in this area. Just a little bit of that. And bring it back. And I'm going to move the paint down to this corner again, just to take a little bit of that white off. Okay. 
Let me take another look at it here. Just going to bring it back a little bit. Okay. Very, very bright, bright painting. Very happy with it. Okay, just going to take another look here a minute. I'm going to fix up my corners. Check the sides here, clean off the bottom. Clean off this bottom here. Okay. And I am going to torch. Like I got paint all over my little torch here. So many very, very pretty areas in this painting. Okay, pretty happy with that. And I think I'll get you down for a close-up. Again, this is a 16 by 20 inch uh, canvas that I did a kiss pour on. Okay, this is the upper left-hand corner. I love the streaks, it's so pretty. Once in a while, you'll see just a little cell of that navy that I put the black in. The lines are so pretty. These colors are beautiful. And the lower, the lower left-hand corner there. Love this lime green. And that streak of orange, beautiful there. Very, very busy in here. Very pretty. This is one of the areas I really like here, how that orange just outlines that area there like that. So pretty. This is up the middle here. So many really nice areas. I like this area too because I got some cells up there. Little muted looking cells. And in here too. Here's the upper right hand corner. And coming down this way.
and here is the lower right hand corner so let me know what you think give me a thumbs up if you like this video share make sure you hit the bell and choose all so you'll know the next time that I post a new video and subscribe if you haven't I'd really appreciate that and also the sharing of the video and until next time take care everybody bye for now